it's your boy DJ Wolf here. Uh, I got a couple things on my mind. Julia 
Julio Jones, then you watch something that was on uh, uh, ESPN about a couple of years ago called uh, Broke, you know, where former uh, NFL, N NBA, and uh, Major League uh, ball players all talked about how they got broke doing stupid shit. You know, you might learn a thing or two from that. I'm sure it's on, on demand somewhere or Netflix. Jesus Christ. As a matter of fact, I might watch that again. Just so I can teach your ass a lesson the next time I go back on, on, on uh, my po next podcast. This is ridiculous. It's totally ridiculous. Really, it's, 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 I, mean, I mean, it's just beyond appalling. I'm offended, even though it wasn't my money. I'm offended that you would even think about spending that kind of money on nothing. I mean, really nothing. He just he just gave away a hundred thousand dollars, and now he lost it at the bottom of this uh, uh, river or lake, wherever the hell it is. They said that, and it's like sixty-five uh, feet down. Sixty-five feet down. They said nothing but branches and trees down, uh, old tree barks and stuff down there. You're likely never to find that thing. I hope not. I hope it'll be a valuable lesson to you. I really hope you don't find it. I'm going to be honest. You know? It's not like you lost a puppy or a human or anybody in that water. You lost a, a, a earring. Let that be a lesson to you, bro. Don't be spending that kind of money on frivolous, or, 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 on, on frivolous shit. For real. That's a lesson you should, a valuable lesson you should learn. Not to waste your money on bullshit, brother. You could have invested that in some small investments. You could have helped a brother or a sister start up a small business or something like that, man. You know, you could you could have helped somebody with that kind of money. Period. You could have helped a couple of families. You could have helped three or four families with that money. No, you want to spend it on yourself on a damn diamond, a damn earring stud. Really? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I hope you learn a valuable lesson from that, so to speak. On the other hand, I hope I get this guy's uh, uh, name right. Uh, he played with the Baltimore Ravens for three years. John Erlebacher, I think. He was an offensive end. Uh, guess what he's going to do? And guess what he had? He had, I guess he was, uh, he was an MIT uh, graduate, and he has a Ph.D., and I think something to do with mathematics or something like that. The dude is brilliant. I don't even know how he, this guy even played in the NFL in the first place, to be honest. And but he played three years. I'm sure he got paid. He got he got his guys coin made his coins out there, and, and he said, you know, I'm going to retire. Not too many NFL players and, and are able to do that. Have have the the, the 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 talent that he has outside of the NFL and retire. At the age of 26, you know, good move, brother. I'm proud of you. That's the way to do it. He's going to retire. He's probably going to start up his own practice while he's actually, uh, you know, I think he's going to go back. Either, either I think he's going to go into practice. I'm not sure, but it didn't really give you that uh, speculation. But I think he is going to go back to, uh, to get another degree or something. I don't know, but smart move. He probably ain't got to earn his, his little money and, and, and put it away. Because he already has another talent outside of the NFL that's going to take him far anyway. Smart move. That's what you do. You know, I mean, come on. You know, I don't have, I don't have a lot of money, nor do I make a lot of money. <laughs> but I'll be honest with you. I do try to save what I can. You know, I have a podcast channel. It's not much. You know, I got a Twitter channel that actually has over a thousand followers. Well over a thousand followers, actually. My YouTube channel, not quite so much. I'm still working to try to improve on that, but, but I'll get it together. But in any case, this has about, been about a tale of two brothers in the NFL. One, Rose Scholar. Earned his coins for three years, got the hell out. Another one, still playing for the NFL, still working for the man, frivolously spend his money on shit he don't really need to the tune of $100,000 and lose it in the swamp. Not too bright of a guy. And there, you see the difference. You see the difference. One of them, only a slave in his own prison 
your boy DJ Wolf. That's all I gotta say about that. I just wanted to get that off my chest and give you something to think about. For y'all youngers who plan on playing for the NFL, hey, you better make the make it the business about uh, investments and I mean wise investments, not frivolous spending. Because otherwise, you can spend all that money you want to, and you can lose all that money just like that, just as fast as you spend it. Best you make investments. Trust me, like a nice 401k package or something like that, you know, and leave it there and not spend your money on frivolous shit, you know, use common sense, man, use common fucking sense, you know, and I would highly recommend you watch the ESPN movie Broke, that's B-R-O to the K to the E, so you learn not to be. Alright, again, this is DJ Wolf. That's all I got to say right now. Of course, questions and comments. <laughs> for all to hear TV on YouTube, for all to hear on Twitter, for all to hear on Facebook, for all to hear on gmail.com, DJ Wolf Online on Facebook, and DJ Wolf Live at yahoo.com. This is DJ Wolf. I got more to say about this and other stuff on the back burner. I'll talk to you guys later.